we'll be investigating the supposed haunting of Eugene O'Neill's mother, Ella. And the story goes as, as follows. Supposedly, while Eugene O'Neill was younger, his mother used to intake morphine. She would be heard, she would be overheard by Eugene in his room, laughing, crying at the same time. And supposedly you can still hear that today. We'll be investigating to find out if any of this is actually true or if it's just a myth. So, let this be the first episode of Mitchell Ghost Hunters. <laughs> I got involved with um, I got involved with the Monte Cristo Cottage about three years ago in terms of um, uh, hooking up with the uh, theater center and then becoming a, a, a tour guide here at the cottage itself. You've got to remember the social status of the time lent itself to the O'Neills being very quiet, secretive, and closeted. So uh, a woman. First of all, drinking or a woman having a drug addiction uh, uh, problem at the turn of the century was just a, a major social taboo. So it would have been hidden. Well, I mean, if you, it's, uh, you know, if you prescribed to ghost stories, I'm sure you could find bumps and, and squeaks in the night here. Uh, I've been here. I've never, never encountered a ghost. Uh, well, my opinion is there are uh, other dimensions, there are other worlds that we are not totally aware of. I don't know how we necessarily are going to prove that empirically or tap into that, but there are definite people who do. There are sensitive people who pick up on phenomena that we don't take um, as, as real, as so-called. Um, but whether that exists here or not, I, I don't know. If you're asking me, am I picking up any other worldly sensations? The answer is no, it's just really cold in here. So if the sixth sense is true, there probably is a presence because it's really cold in here. I'm going to be explaining some of the equipment that we are going to be using. Uh, the first thing is a mini amplifier and it comes with a sensor. So basically uh, you put the headphones on and you turn the, the volume on and you basically hear uh, like a humming noise and if there is anything around it, it will make the humming louder so you'll know that there's something there. Uh, the next thing is a gauze meter which basically uh, this is the gauze meter and you basically press this button on the side and uh, it raises from zero to one, uh, from zero to ten or a chime, depending on on what you put here. Excellent. Hello, Neil. Are you still here? Just say yes. Please. Well, you wouldn't say, like, wait, just say yes. Well, that was because I just went like that. Is that correct? It was salvaged and brought here. This room, other than the furniture, is identical to the way it was. Pretty creepy. Is there anyone here? Would anyone like to show themselves? In some way, shape, or form? Could you make the chair rock? 